Hi guys and welcome to another video by Tram Vegan and Frodo. Thank you so much for being here again on the channel. Hopefully you're having a beautiful, wonderful day, whatever you're choosing to do. You're enjoying the outdoors, the sunshine, the weather, the sport that you choose to do. And you're just living a really fun, happy, exciting life. Um, so today, as you may know, uh, based on the title, of this video we are reviewing a gyro or gyro atmos helmet this is what it looks like i the actual helmet came out i think in 2015 or so but um so it's not brand new or anything but it is very new to me because <laughs> i've been wanting it for a while and i only got it recently and like i paid for it myself it's fine but i bought it uh, second hand so I knew someone who was selling it and I wanted it basically this is a size medium I'll show you how it fits there's heaps and heaps and heaps of um, vents in it as you can see like insane amount of little vents, vents, vents this is how it fits there's like a little adjustable dial at the back and you have your straps that you can adjust as well what it looks like inside I got it in this uh, fluorescent yellow in uh, black color I've actually really wanted a fluorescent yellow helmet or helmet with fluorescent yellow just because I think you can see and be more visible on the road so basically there's insane amount of vents here as you can see it's it's seriously um, it is very compact and your head stays very, very cool, very chilled. It doesn't sweat as much. And it's it's really good. I actually really, really like it. It is, this one is, like I said, in size mirror, uh, medium. <laughs> it is 55 to 59 millimeters. It's 265 grams. So it's actually pretty, pretty light. It's, um, it's pretty aerodynamic with the design. So it's pretty fun. I actually really like it. Um, I think it's very expensive what they try to sell it to you at the shop. Uh, in Australia here, they sell it for 170, and I've seen it them these ones even for 215, in, in the shops, and that's too expensive. Don't pay that. Just wait till you find it on sale. I got it for 55, and then I had to pay for shipping. So it was like 65, 70 dollars for this helmet. There are. There is a little micro dial at the back. It does little bang bang. And you can adjust the length. And there are straps here that you can change your width, like how long and whatnot you want them to be. And uh, yeah, there it is. This insane amount of vents. It is very light. It is very comfortable to wear. It is very compact, but also it makes you feel like it's it's really staying on your head. The only thing that I would say is a um, not a minus, but desirable feature on the helmet, I think. Uh, or one, obviously, appropriate price, <laughs> not freaking two hundred or one hundred and eighty dollars for a helmet. But also the little um, front cap thing, like in my old helmet. I'm still using this as well but you know how they have this little kind of cap thing I find that very very helpful when you are on the like protecting from Sun and it kind of stops you like do you see that it like kind of protects your nose and kind of blocks the Sun a little bit but of course you can wear um, sunny sweat and stuff and wear sunscreen on your nose but um, yeah this one is heaps smaller and you just bang bang easily fix it up easy let's go I really like it it's very aerodynamic it keeps your head cool it's very light 265 grams and um, yeah easily adjustable what more can you want from a helmet and as well as with these fluorescent um, colors that's exactly what I wanted in fact I wanted this helmet for like over a year now when I saw it in the shop for the first time and um, yeah and then it just turned up more than hundred dollars cheaper and this is how it's like comparable to my old uh, helmet so it's, it's it's like 
The shape is a lot more aerodynamic, you know, with all these little things. There's heaps more vents, you can see. There's way more vents, way more room for air to flow through. And um, it doesn't have the little cap thing in the front. And it's smaller. There you go. Hopefully it's helpful. Hopefully it's interesting. I really like it. I wouldn't buy it for the crazy cost of $180 or $200. But I think it's incredible. It's an incredible, it's a really good helmet and I really like it. So hopefully you have a really good helmet as well and you don't ride a bike without it. And um, yeah, it's easy, adjustable, very light and visible. Easy to use and visible. All right, thanks for watching. Hopefully this has been helpful and gave you an update on the video. Um, see, it is another thing though that I thought I'd mention actually, I should mention it while we're at it, is a hygiene, helmet hygiene. Make sure that, like it has these little sticky things inside there, just make sure that you give them a wash pretty regularly after you use it because you know you don't want to be, you want, it all, you want your helmet to be clean and hygienic and your skin on your face and in your head just in good condition basically when you can just like in the old helmet i actually actually i've never talked about this huh um i'd wash these things all the time and they get like one out i actually had to sew them back together because they fall apart but that's right just because i wear it so much and obviously you also should probably be washing these straps as well because you sweat and your sweat is like going down your face and yeah, it kind of gets strapped in your paws and stuff and it's not very good for the paws, especially if you're a girl. I'm sorry. <laughs> you care about it just like that little bit more, I guess. Um, yeah, but other than that, sweet. We just wear the helmet, whichever one you like. When you try it, uh, trying it on, make sure it fits your head, it's the right size for you and you feel good wearing it. And like obviously if you really want to find something you think you look good in, but... I think it's kind of not as important. By the way, wearing a helmet just means you're doing cool, sh cool stuff on your bike. <laughs> and that's always cool. <laughs> so um, I'll see you again soon. Thanks for watching. And remember to stay safe on the road. Always wear a helmet. Remember to take care of your helmet and wash your, all your little pads inside. Wash your straps. And yeah, take care of it. Make sure it's in good condition. Make sure it's tight on your head so it can take care of you when it may need to. See you again soon. Thanks for watching another video. See ya, bye.